What is it, Greninja and Min Min, Min uh, at yeah. Ghost? Yeah. I mean, yeah. <laughs> I have to think about it for a second. But before we can do all that, we are going to the main event right now because everyone's China's begging for it. Up too. They're so okay. pretty. Okay. They're unwrapped. Yeah. <laughs> they still have the wrapping on them. That's fine. They're they're mint condition. You could you could say, which I will. Now what I will say is. I'm gonna say for the game back on. <laughs> they're so funny. Okay. Even though the quad is no longer being displayed, we're still recording every match that goes to the quad, and they will be uploaded to YouTube. That's, yes. That's at the, the end of the day. So you will, you Devin, will see Toby. Because I Devin promise. is a mad genius. If you want to see those Toby matches, just check House of 3000 YouTube, like, tomorrow. Tomorrow, yeah. yeah. They'll be uploaded by Helper, tomorrow. Helper takes the videos and uploads them yep. on his fast, very fast computer. Damn, Carflow. Yeah. Carflow making a literally an insane, uh, insane start right there in the very beginning. Getting Poke Hector to second stock already and only 62% now on himself. Super, super good start for, for him. And what, what can we say? That's Carflow. A very yeah. impressive. One of the best, one of the things that Carflow always wants to do, and why he can struggle with, uh, why he can struggle and want to pivot off of Roy for some weirder matchups or for some slower paced characters, is the fact that he just wants to jump at you. Yep. He just wants to jump on you, press forward air, press up air, press with these super uber safe, sweet spots, and go ham. And K. Rule just kind of lets you do that sometimes, unless you're playing extremely, extremely focused on the preemptive strikes with Crown or with like a preemptive forward air. Mm -hmm. Like keeping space against a character as fast as Roy is so hard. Especially as K-Roll, right? Because he's yeah. way slower, he's way bigger, you kind of fall into all those arrows that Carfo is going for. But when, you, when you've kind of fallen into the big the big uh, hurt boxes that K-Roll does have, you die, you know? And that's what Carfo has to slowly reel back and realize. Now we're getting that grab, going for a down throw, trying to get the platform extension, but, you know, we do see Pokemon are able to get out of that situation relatively safely. You're biggie. You're, you're biggie. You're biggie. You're, bi you're biggie. Big you're heavy. Look at them. He's you're like, living. Of all of all the sizes, I definitely say he's a biggie. He's definitely a biggie. He's a biggie. Oh, Not really a small. Oh, just in there. Not high enough to get everything in the up air. And uh, you die for it, smile. Boom. <laughs> Boom. First of all, wait. I didn't even notice. I don't know why I didn't mention this. You took Roy to TNC. Yeah, I didn't want to say anything. Was like, well, I'll I guess mention it. <laughs> I'll say it. I don't care. Why do that? Okay, I guess K. Rule doesn't mind this stage, so you can get some cheeky kills with a with like a dash attack or something, back throw being particularly deadly. Um, you have options here as a cheesy character on a cheeser's paradise, but it's also Roy on Town and City. <laughs> like that's just, so it's like, it's just damn. not the wave. <laughs> <laughs> it's not the wave, brother. It's yeah, not the wave. You know what's not the wave? These mismatched colors. Yeah, I was Disconnect. about to say, they, they did this on purpose and went to players two and three. Okay. I know. G disconnect your Pro Controllers. Look what happens. Devin might have technology for this. I'll look into it when this game starts. If the question is, does Devin have technology for this? The Always. answer is probably Always. yes. Always. Here, let me see. Let me see. We'll see. We're, we're, we're seeing right now. Going over to the battlefield, regular battlefield, all triplat. K rule. Ideally, should be okay. Yeah. But you were going to fall on these platforms. Because you're going to fall into K. Uh, that K. Roll. Oh, jump. Roy up there. We're going to come back. We're going to have Carful off stage. It's it's the counter type of counter pick that you want to have because you get to utilize K. Roll's zoning tools to consume a lot more space, and you're not as worried about Roy playing the backdash game on a stage like Battlefield. Instead, oh, nice. You got Roy pinned down in the corner. You need to close out the edge guard. Oh, got clipped by the blazer before he being able to go off stage. Kind of unfortunate. Huh? Oh, that was a trade and a half. But it favors Carfo more. He goes up, comes right back down as a fast faller. You're back on stage. You're on the ledge. You get the, you get the spot dodge. You get the F tilt. Yeah. yeah. You're dead. That was, that was some real <laughs> smash ultimate gaming, as was the down throw Barry. Just... Oh boy, I'd really like a kill confirmed here, Bob. <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> oh boy! <laughs> <laughs> oh, I wish they could see us. They didn't see what we were doing. It's okay. They will never understand. If you know, you know, you don't, you don't. Oh, damn. Down throw into triple up air, quadruple up air, quintuple up air. Okay. <laughs> Roy gets so much on uh, off of down throw at low percent. Even more than Krom does, because Krom can't do like down throw nair, because the nair will miss. Yep. Uh, but both of them can do up airs, and on Battlefield, just the damage just racks up so, so crazy. Playing the dash back game, not That's able so to get it. It's so crazy. All right, the armor is helping K. Rool a lot here to not get, you know, side, uh, to not get stage spiked, not to really think about these side situations that other people would have to think about more often. But what we are, what we have to be really careful about is that percentage. You have that rage oh, yeah. build up, you have 
you're big, you got the furry, you're dead. Carpho, stop running in. You're Roy, I know. That's what he wants to do. And that's, I feel like the hard part about Carflo is while he's able to adapt pretty rapidly to defensive mix-ups and call out a lot of defensive options pretty well, for characters or players that are able to meet <gasps> offense with offense, you can get pretty, you, you can oh find God, a lot of trouble very quickly. Look at all these pivot grabs. Like, I, po Poke Hector has just been pivot grabbing center stage because he knows Carflo wants to do Roy things and run off this platform with an aerial. You're gone. See you later. Game number three. Like, honestly, just getting called out for being a robot. No, you you got called out for being a Roy player. <laughs> you got called out for running in for... Not running in in the sense of, like, being mindless. You're running in because you're Roy. You have that fa that fast ground speed. You have a little tip 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 tip, -tip, -tip. You have good aerials. You have, like, like good approaching aerials. And you got caught out by it. You you got caught out by I'm a call this a ro I'm gonna call this a Roy player back air. Like, I told oh you, boy, Roy. I'm dashing around here, falling off. That's so easy. I'm can just gonna run off the platform and press buttons and poke so stop doing that. Stop doing that. I'm <laughs> K rule. I'm not gonna die that he, easily. And then he kept doing it. I'm at 150. <laughs> I have mad rage. I'm gonna I have a Rob Berry! <laughs> I'm gonna put you on the ground, I'm gonna shake you. <laughs> so like, quick update. Shake him down for your money, bro. Except oh my god. What's happening? Uh, because we're a little short staff, Helper came in and informed me that we should stay on Quad because there's no one to really like run these stream scenes. And you know, he told me very calmly in his normal yelling voice. <laughs> Classic in, Helper. In his, in his voice. His talking <laughs> voice where he's yelling where he's somehow you. yelling at he you. He just sounds disappointed in you, man. Okay, that's fine. <laughs> yeah, that's fine. Right. So that's yeah, completely so we'll go back to Quad after this. Okay, great. We'll do more Quad. So for we'll those who want to see Toby, uh, there you sorry go. about that. Yeah, but Toby that now. means I denied them. Toby content. They'd be all right. <laughs> this I mean, Obon beat, this Obon beat Toby, so Toby's just out. Oh. Unfortunate. Oh. Toby, I'm sorry. And Toby, we couldn't see your demise. But the, anyway. last, the last that set will be on YouTube in a day, so. Oh, sevens in chat. Greninja's is really cool character. In sometimes. I think he's just cool in general. It depends on the matchup you see, because sometimes Greninja be the dash back plot, but sometimes he's legitimately very interesting. Like, uh, unlike Roy right now, which... Yeah, I mean, this... What's there to say about the matchup on screen? <laughs> like, oh boy, three stocks to one. Again. Oh boy, I'm, I'm, I'm playing Roy. Oh boy, I'm Roy. I love Carpho. I, I always mess with him, with, with him all the time. I mean, he doesn't want to be joking with him, but... No, that's just my Roy impression. He's like an actual child. <laughs> he's an orphan. Yeah. <laughs> Poor guy. Yeah, bro, he's like 15 and a sad orphan. He'd be all right. We hate Elliewood. <laughs> <laughs> all right. Carpho... PS2, forward throw. Forward throw. <laughs> that's fair play, that's baby. Forward, that's forward throw gaming. That'd be forward throw. Jab, okay, no. back air. Oh, no, that was, that was sad. Definitely, that was definitely jab. Now, what if you Damn. down air? What, okay, you are jumping. <laughs> it just it just sucks as Poke Actor had like a really good game, too, that like really showed Carflo who was boss for a second. Right. And then Carflo was like, okay, bet. I'm going to show you who's the CEO. Don't worry about it. Now, hold on. Wait, pause. Pause. Because you saw, remember, remember what happened last game? This. Yeah, Roy, uh, oh, okay. Carpo turned off his brain, but no, nah, he, he that, turned on. That time roll. he turned it back on. Tech rolled in. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah cause the common, the common combo out of uh, forward throw for K rule is forward throw dash attack, which is just solid damage, gets you like 25 to 30 percent, like, and gets you gets you moving forward. But I guess with the amount of rage that Poke Hector was sporting, what was it like, 150 yep. or so. That let Carflow hold down in a way, or maybe it's just a fast faller thing. Either way, he's able to tech roll out of that and then just immediately take center. Excuse me. You're excused. Oh, thank you. <laughs> Remember, we'll be going to quad stream we'll momentarily, so you will be able to see more Poke Hector content. Yay! Poke Hector! If you wanted to see more of them just doing King K rule things. Yeah, but for now, for now, get added. Carol's always oh, like right one now. of those one of those characters that has like minuscule advantages that I find so funny. Like obviously you have stuff like the the belly armor in combined with the normal super armor, but I always find like Carol's uh, standing jab to be insanely good. Like his dash dance to be really or his initial dash rather is like really good for no reason. Like um, he's certain frame data as well. Like there's a lot to Carol. That's like, oh, you have a lot of these like little things going for you. It's too bad you're giant and combo food and like. And I'm Roy. <laughs> and, I, and 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 Carflow's Roy. 
sometimes it'd be like that. That's kind of just like the the takeaway that all heavies kind of have, or all big heavies have, right. where it's like, it's like Falco, and, and, not Falco, Falcon and Kazi, who are like,